So this is a Greek word, ble. Ah, okay. Oh, okay. Okay. I actually talk really slow. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. I understand English. <laughs> No, but I had Spanish in school, so but it's still yeah, like I'm really too. bad at it. Hey. I have one A2 level. <laughs> oh, oh. oh. Like, I can only understand. Oh, well, that's mm. already that's it. yeah. it's good enough. It's yeah, good it's enough. good enough. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I guess sometimes if you speak very slowly, I might understand as well. But I feel like it's also been so long ago that I don't remember anything. And even back then, I was bad. At it. I think our grandma is pretty similar. Yeah, maybe. Like, we because we come from the Latin. Yeah, yeah, yeah, yes, yes. I think in our case it's more something about phonetics, like... And we're also speaking very, very fast. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. We're really speaking very fast. I think we have like this R sound that mm. we pronounce it differently <laughs> than like... English like ra re ri ru ru yeah oh <laughs> yeah brr, like, like my name is Mary but in Greek it's like Mary like we roll it okay, okay. <laughs> yeah. yeah we do we have different sounds like ra and ra too so there is two that is very specific from Spain from over oh. over Spanish easy because every single word even an object has a gender oh, <laughs> they somehow yeah too. Uh, yeah yeah, for yeah, like yeah different so, words. so I felt interesting because why is it that for me it has different gender? Gender. Yeah, it's I just the other way around. It. Yeah. And also, yeah, in Turkish. Do you have? Do you gender? have? <laughs> it's all Greek to me. Oh my god! Oh, no. <laughs> I mean, we don't have gender. At all? No. no. Oh. Easier. Do you conjugate the verbs? No. No. Like we we add it in the end. Like Korean, Hungarian. Oh. Mm. So the word is yogurt. Can you guess? What it could be in German. Uh -huh. The funny thing is, I know it in Spanish and not in English. <laughs> oh my god. I don't know. It might be similar, right? Oh my god. Three, two, one. Well, uh, yeah. I, I, I think my spelling is wrong. I don't know I if it's your word or wrong too. Oh in my Spanish, god. The Spanish and English spelling is quite difficult, mm. right? I wouldn't know how to spell it either. But it's it's true. Yeah. It's oh. It is that one. Okay. Yeah. Well, it's also funny German. because it's the same pronunciation as the English one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yogurt. Yogurt. How would you say yogurt in your language? Exactly the same. Yogurt. Exactly the same. Oh, yogurt. <laughs> yogurt. Yogurt. Oh, that's cute. Very similar. <laughs> yogurt. Yogurt. Yogurt. It's shorter. Oh, similar. Oh, that sounds yeah. cool. With the R. <laughs> okay, next one is an Italian word, and we spell it like this: gatta. Okay, so mm. yeah, I think not probably it's not a, but a full friend. We did. Okay. <laughs> one, two, three. Ah, uh, almost. Gatta word in Italian means a cat, but it's the female version of cat. So when you talk about a female cat, you have to say gatta. Instead, if you had to talk about a male cat, it would be gatto. But yeah, it's cat, it's like not red. <laughs> not red. <laughs> very, very similar in Spanish. So I'm curious now, how do you say cat in your language? Uh, di katze. So it's quite different. <laughs> I <laughs> couldn't have told, yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, but it sounds like a bad word in my English. <laughs> katze. <laughs> ah, <laughs> I didn't okay, know. Okay, I don't know it. what I said in your language. It's okay. Uh, the female cat is la gata. So in Greek it's rata. So rata. it's not G, it's R, rata. Oh. So it's very similar. How do you say rat? Rat? Oh. Oh, it's completely different. Completely different. Kitty. Kitty. Oh, sounds that's like cute. Kitty. Cute. Yeah, yeah, sounds like Kitty. Yeah. <laughs> so the pronunciation is very different. So how did you guess that this word was cat? I checked Mary's. Oh my <laughs> god, seriously. <laughs> <laughs> nice time. I was cheating. Okay. <laughs> well, so the next word is crema. Crema. I think it pr probably is same as my language. It's written and spelled the same way, okay. but it can have two meanings. Yeah, oh. we too. Right? Okay. Okay. Three, two, one. <laughs> Voila. Oh, oh. <laughs> Voila. Oh, oh. oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So yes, you you got it all correct. The the answer is cream, and we have two meanings. Can be cream for like for the skin to be applied and also can be these sweet creams that you use uh, in yeah, cooking. Yeah. yeah, depends on the context. Okay, so <laughs> how you say cream also in your language? 
Uh, in German, I would say creme. Uh, for me, spelled and written the same. Crema. Crema. Oh, <laughs> oh okay. okay. Exactly the same. Yeah. For us, like the cream that you use on your face or whatever is like creme. Mm. But like crema uh -huh. uh, is cooking cream. Oh, okay. So that's why I wrote cooking cream first. Mm. See. That's interesting. It's like creme and crema. Yeah, mm. like you wouldn't say crema to any cream that you use on your oh. face or body. Haha. <laughs> Well, <laughs> we have a problem with the Greek. <laughs> <laughs> so this is a Greek word, and it's pronounced as ble. <gasps> ble. Ble. Ble. I would have, I would have read it completely different. Oh my god! How? Like <laughs> matai. <laughs> <laughs> can you guess what it means? I have no, no idea. idea. I mean, really? You so. can, can you give us a context? Okay, I will let you know. Okay, it's a color. Okay. Ah, okay. Oh, okay. Now it's super easy. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. Yeah. Two, three, two, one. Already I showed. Oh, no, I say blue. Yeah, because bla uh, black is different in German. Yeah, yeah. so that's how you guess. Yeah. Mm. So it's blue. But uh, black is completely different. It's mavro. In German, I think I know the word in German. Yeah, it's blau. Yeah, so I think that was so similar. It's kind of similar. It in Italian. A blue is blue, but it's uh, spelled differently. You can, you, in English, you write it with a E at the mm. end. It's just simply don't write the E. Yet. Oh, just with But you, you, you pronounce the same. Uh, you know, in, in my brain, I was like <laughs> trying to remind other languages, and it sounded to me like a little bit English and also, especially mm. French. Oh. So I thought, I don't know anything about French, but I think they use something similar for blue. blue. Maybe like they have blue. blue. What about um, in Turkey? Yeah, it's different. It's mavi. Because uh, we say mauve for purple. So yeah. it's, it more, sounds so similar. It's more in Turkish. Mauve. In Turkish, it's more. Uh, so this is a Turkish word, harita. So can you guess mm. what it means? Can we get a hint? Like yeah, we yeah. have a We need one. Is it a pronoun? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah. you can use it if you have printed out. Printed. Oh or you can use it like an online one. We all oh. use it online. With all the rest, but sounds okay. to me like Japanese. <laughs> oh yeah, like, me too. <laughs> yeah, you're right. You use it to find your way. Oh. oh. Ah. <laughs> Three? Yes. Oh, well, okay. Yeah. Yes, it's a map. <laughs> How do you guys say map in your language? Mapa. It's masculine in Spanish. Oh, look. El mapa. It's di Ah, mm. it's female. It's female. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> in Greek, it's kind of similar, I think. Hartis. It it's is. like artis. <laughs> hartis. So, ah. hartis. Your hints, I thought it meant happiness or something. You can use it online or you can print it out. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, but no, no print it out. I wish we yeah. could print happiness. <laughs> Hi, my name is Lily and I schreibe gerade meine Bachelorarbeit. I have no idea. Couldn't think of anything else. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I just understood. Uh, yeah, my hello, is. my name is Lily. Oh, yeah. that's <laughs> really hard. But you're right. Oh, the rest is so I just said that my name is Lily, and I said hello. Um, and then I'm writing my thesis right now. Are you that writing your thesis? That's a very thesis. difficult word. <laughs> <laughs> How is thesis? Um, it's bachelor arbeit. Transition was very different. Ciao a tutti, mi chiamo Sofia, ho 26 anni e vengo dall'Italia. Okay, one, two, three. Show. Sure. Yeah. Hi everyone, my name is Sofia, I'm 26 years old and I come from Italy, correct? <laughs> yeah, that's correct, that's what I said, yeah. I just said. I'm struggling to Hello. put it in English. Ah, so I is put it writing in Spanish? Yeah, I put it just in Spanish and after I translate it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I would have gotten the, um, the age part if I oh. hadn't had Spanish in school. So Same. that's from my uh, Spanish class. So. Spanish helped. Yeah, Spanish is similar. I started counting in my head to make sure I got the correct so, How do you say 26 years old in Spanish? 26. 26. So yeah. 6 was same, uh, right? 26 is very similar. And then it's yeah, okay, yeah. right? Ah, okay, okay. Well, so I'm going to also introduce myself in Spanish. Hola, mi nombre es Andrea 
y soy mallorquina y uh, me gusta mucho estar hoy con vosotras haciendo el programa. Me he visto el vídeo de igual. It's ok. It's ok. <laughs> Hi, my name is Andrea, I'm Mallorcan. I like it a lot that we are all here on this program. Oh, oh, oh, this is a pro level. Hello, my name is Andrea, I am something cute. I am very happy to do this shooting with you. Yeah, well, at least the minute I change it, that was my fault. So Mallorquina, I, I kind of guessed it, that it was your uh, where you coming from, mm. you were, where you were coming from. But it's funny because it's, when you say Ina in my in my language, it's like adding cuteness to ah, the word. Like something. So like I, oh. I, I assumed it. Oh my God, something cute. I'm cute. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Hi, I'm Andrea, and I'm cute. <laughs> so there is any word that is similar to Turkish? No. Wow. I didn't catch mm. anything. Yes, yes. Me lene Mary, ejo spudasi germaniki glosa ke filologia. Oh my god. Ke shere me para poli pu sas gnorisa. I'm sorry, that sounds like a very hard disease to be like. Oh, oh my god. Okay. So I guessed one more thing, but I'm just gonna tell you. Um, uh, you studied German for one year. Oh, you're so close. Wow. Oh. I, I understood philology. Me too. I heard something similar in oh. your pronunciation. Yeah, in, it, in Italian it's completely different. Yeah. But I guessed it from the English. So I just guessed. And then also one year sounded similar. Okay, so I said, hello, my name is Mary. I studied German language and literature, uh, actually German philology. Uh -huh. And I'm very happy to meet you all. Oh, yeah, that, that, that, that was no, no, no. There is a word. <laughs> and it's similar also in Italian, it's oh, conoscere. Okay, con conoscere. Something like that? Meeting. So I thought this is uh, knowing. Yeah. Oh. Um, knowing you. Um, yeah. I just understood your name and the philology part. Oh. Then you said it again, then I didn't hear it again, then I just raised oh, no. it. <laughs> I was like, I guess I heard it wrong. Oh. But yeah. Now is your time. <laughs> <laughs> it's your revenge for Olivia, just this. Merhaba, benim adım Olivia. Ankaralıyım. İngilizce dil ve edebiyatı, bir de film ve kültür okudum. <gülüyor> Turkish also sounds really fast. Oh my god, especially oh. in the beginning. Wow. This is so... Uh, <gülüyor> <gülüyor> okay, we... Yeah, it's similar. <gülüyor> Because in Greek, mera is day. So I thought maybe good morning or good day. Uh. I just Hello. catch the words that are like international, like I guess yeah. she was saying her name, uh, so <coughs> it, it's like my name is, and Ankora because sounds the same as English. I think yeah. you say mm. to study English, but be because of English yeah. words. Yeah, English. I heard something about English and culture. then culture. Mm. Okay, how do you say English in your language? Aglica. English. English. English. So I think it's quite similar. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. So that's still why didn't maybe why it. most of us got it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well. Uh, <laughs> cute, cute, cute. Yeah, I'm cute. <laughs> so I said, uh, like, my name, hello. My mm. name is Olivia. I'm from Ankara, which is like the capital city. Okay. Mm. And I said, I studied English literature uh, and uh, film and culture. Uh, uh, university. Yeah. Uh, I heard literature we somehow in there too, but I didn't never write it down. It. I just how, how do you say literature? Edebiyat. No, no, no, maybe no, I didn't. No. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I'm not good. Or just maybe I made it up myself. <laughs> I go. Challenging. Well, I think it was really interesting that we are a little bit similar after it. Yeah, we, we <laughs> still understand the new word, struggling and struggling. my poor Olivia. Uh, I'm always the old one now. Yeah. Oh. I just had the feeling because I never heard a Greek, like many, not many words together, mm. like maybe one word here mm. and another, so I'm not uh, used to her hearing like a yeah, sentence. Yeah, in Greek, but I feel that I'm, I'm Quite, I feel motivated to to learn Greek oh. because I think I can be good. Normally, I'm very bad in other languages, but <laughs> oh, I 
Greek has a like a sound that I think that helps can, a lot. Yeah, yeah that I think I can mimic it. Different it sounds, sounds very cute. I actually talk really slow. <laughs> well, it sounds very yeah. quick. <laughs> so, <laughs> we have so many Turkish words in Greek. Yeah. So I was expecting I would I would catch something, but like same here. <laughs> I was yeah, yeah, no, it's it. it. <laughs> We have so many words, even like phrases. Yeah, I feel mm-hmm. like yeah, they always like. I could they they use it. <laughs> I don't know. I don't catch anything. I don't know why. <laughs> I was trying so hard, but... Well, so today we try if we could understand each other. <laughs> okay, so if you liked the video, please like, subscribe and leave a comment. We'll see you soon. Bye! Bye. Bye.